I'm pretty sure that Sam Darnold just became the next quarterback for the Cleveland Browns last night. So the Redskins traded Alex Smith. The Redskins acquired Alex Smith in a trade with the Kansas City Chiefs. And now Kirk Cousins needs to find a new football team. So where will Kirk Cousins go? He has all kinds of options. He has the Cleveland Browns. He has the Denver Broncos, the Jacksonville Jaguars. Now, I really truly believe this decision is between the Denver Broncos and the Jacksonville Jaguars. People, don't, people think the Browns are going there. Again, I, I hope, I want Kirk Cousins to sign for the Browns. I want good things for the Cleveland Browns. Uh, but I, I, I don't think it's going to happen. Now, the Browns could offer Kirk Cousins a ton of money. Maybe that, maybe that entices him, maybe it doesn't. Again, I'm rooting for the Cleveland Browns comeback. I want the Browns to win. But the process of a turnaround is a long process. And if he goes to Jacksonville or Denver, he can win. So you can make money in Denver and Jacksonville, and you can win, whereas the Browns pretty much only offer you money and an opportunity to maybe turn around a franchise. That's cool if that works, but I just don't think it's going to happen. I think the Browns are a messy organization, and Kirk Cousins probably will not end up there. So ask yourself, do you, again, if, if maybe you're mad. Maybe you don't understand why he wouldn't go to the Browns. You can sell out and make a ton of money and have a potentially miserable life, or you can make some money, take a little less, and have fun in the playoffs with the, Brown, with the Broncos or the Jacksonville Jaguars. I don't think he goes to Cleveland. I do not believe Kirk Cousins will go to Cleveland. So then it's between the Jaguars and the Broncos, and I believe Kirk Cousins would choose the Broncos over the Jacksonville Jaguars. Here's why. First of all, uh, not even why. I just want to point out, do the Jaguars even go after Kirk Cousins? We're all assuming the Jacksonville Jaguars are going to make Kirk Cousins a big offer. Mm, I don't know. I really don't know. Like, how good is Kirk Cousins? If the Jaguars had, ha had had Kirk Cousins in the playoffs, do you think they would have beat the Patriots and be playing in the Super Bowl right now? No. I don't believe so. If the Jaguars had had Kirk Cousins this season, I don't think their season ends any differently. Pointing that out, I don't know. But I also want to point out this. There are two options. You could date two girls. For, well, I'm using this example. If you could date two girls, one of them broke up with their boyfriend yesterday, and one of them broke up with, has been single for two years. So a girl's been single for two years, or the other girl broke up with her boyfriend yesterday. Which one do you go for? I would rather not date the girl who just broke up with her ex. I would rather avoid the girl who's still tr crying over her ex-boyfriend. One of the teams after Kirk Cousins, the Jacksonville Jaguars, has a guy named Blake Bortles who's in the way of Kirk Cousins. So, so one team, the Jacksonville Jaguars, still has Blake Bortles. They still like Blake Bortles. Their locker room is around Blake Bortles. The other locker room, the Denver Broncos, the other option for Kirk Cousins has players openly saying they want you to come to their franchise. Vaughn Miller, one of the stars on defense for the Denver Broncos, came out today and said, Kirk Cousins can put us over the edge. Kirk Cousins can help us win a championship. I believe Kirk Cousins chooses Denver. Avoid that nasty mess that is the Jacksonville Jaguars quarterback situation. I don't think you want to go into a locker room that's divided over, oh, we want Blake, we want Kirk. I don't, I don't want that situation. I want to go somewhere that wants me. The Denver Broncos have a great roster. They can win with Kirk Cousins. They will win tomorrow. They, I mean, they have a fantastic roster. They're just missing a quarterback. And again, the Denver Broncos want Kirk Cousins. And being wanted is half the battle, I'm telling you. The Redskins didn't want Kirk Cousins, and it drove them nuts. Really, all you got to say is, hey, we're the Denver Broncos. We're going to pay you a lot of money. We're going to win a lot of games. And we want you here in Denver. That goes a long ways. They also have John Elway. They have one of the greatest quarterbacks of all time. He's not really, he's on a top five maybe, but he's not, he's not, he's not Joe Montana or Tom Brady, but he's one of the greatest quarterbacks of all time. I would guarantee Kirk Cousins grew up watching John Elway. And if you can be influenced by John Elway, you take that opportunity. My dad and I talk about, uh, cause I struggle. I, I hate college. I want to leave yada yada. My dad says, the only reason you should leave college, Zach is if you are offered a job working for Colin Coward, I don't care if it's in the mailroom. If you can be around Kirk, uh, if you can be around Colin Coward, that's what my dad says to me. My dad says, if you can be around Colin Coward, your favorite broadcaster in the entire world, if you can be around him, you take that job. Because his influence could help me. His influence, just being around him, 
You want that. If you can be around John Elway, if you can be around influence like that, I believe that's a, it's a real actual thing that matters to Kirk Cousins. To, to learn to have, to have dinner with John Elway regularly, come on, man. Come on. If I'm Kirk Cousins, that actually is a big selling point to me. So ultimately, again, I believe Kirk Cousins will go to the Denver Broncos. Thank you so very much for watching this video. If you're watching on Facebook or on YouTube, please help me grow by sharing this with your friends on Facebook, on Twitter, on Reddit. Help me grow by telling your friends about Strong Opinion Sports. And if you want more, if you like this podcast, if you like my content, you can find Strong Opinion Sports on iTunes, on SoundCloud, and also on YouTube.